Greetings, series. We're here some more Persona 5 Royal. And if you didn't see the last episode, there's a little bit of a spoiler warning right now, but like, it's kind of cool. We took out freaking Okumura, except someone else actually took him out. He's freaking dead. He, that means he's gonna have a freaking mental shutdown, which is absolutely crazy. So that's gonna happen in like 11 days, so we're just gonna have to wait until the change of heart. Um, but let's see, can we maybe play some game, or like that freaking game, Train of Life, one more time, finish it up before we uh, move on to something else? I don't know, I can't even go out today, so it's fine. Yeah, Train of Life, blah, 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 use technique, yeah, I know, I'm not doing anything with luck, luck always sucks. Never trust a luck game. Okay, advanced course, extra tough since it's the last level. Why well, they get things are going well for now, we'll probably end up in first place at this rate. First place as opposed to, oh. Shoot, a hole opened up in the ground and swallowed our piece. Wait, is that some kind of gun? Uh, the name's Artie, Artie Lurie, the freewheeling cannon. Is that supposed to be like some sort of pun, Artie Lurie? Artillery? Art is it supposed to be artillery? <laughs> if you don't give me a number I like, I'm gonna blast you all the way back to the beginning. Ah, uh, the training, uh, the train of oddballs just keeps on rolling. I'm all for number four. That means you can either get four, eight, or twelve. Basically, if the sum of your two dice you roll is a multiple of four, you win. Naturally, you'll have four shots at it. And now if you win, let's see. I'll blast you to the finish line. Uh, wait, so we can get all the way to the goal if we roll the right number? Let's do this, Ren. Okay, that seems kind of easy. Um, so now I can roll six times. Boom. That's six. That's not a four. All right, um... Boop, that's another six. Rip, 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 rip. Okay, let's try one, two, three, four. Is that, that's it? That works, that's eight. That works. Whoa, eight, you did it. Yeah, I didn't even need to use a cheat. Way to go. As promised, I'll shoot you on over to the finish line. Whoa, all the way to the end in an instant. Yeah, give me that freaking win. Ah, uh, the secret technique book helped, huh? Yeah, I know it did, I know it did, Morgana. We finished this game and now I'm gonna get another freaking code to exchange for a freaking accessory that I'm never gonna use. Isn't that awesome, Morgana? That's oh. so cool. What is it called this time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, promotion from years ago. Yeah, how many of these freaking promotions did you even get? Railroad card? Yeah. My goodness. These games are fun, I guess. Oh. Hey, Igor. What's going on, dude? It's been a while since we've chatted. Thought you wanted to chat with me after I beat the palace, but, uh... Looks like we made a great miscalculation, inmate. Oh. Uh, oh, they know. They must know. Contrary to our assumptions, it seems you have turned out to be quite promising. Oh, you're talking about me rather than Okumura's death? Your powers continue to grow, as do the relationships you hold with your contract. Yeah, I'm keeping up with it, Igor. Don't worry. It seems the rehabilitation is proceeding at a fine rate. Thank you. I've been trying. Um, uh, hmm. <laughs> Allow me to warn you on one matter. Oh, black mask. Being at the peak may mean you are mere moments from your downfall. Oh, Igor, you know. Unexpected situations are necessary in a game, after all. Yes, have you ever heard of Persona 5 Royal? I've playing it recently, but except my PS4 broke, so now I lost all my save data, and I have to start all the way from the beginning. I can't, I can't lose our set again. I can't take it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him laugh while I leave, really? I think he's so funny. You think you're so funny, Ego? Wait, Morgana again? This is what happened with Morgana. Yeah. Um. What the heck? Morgana, that dream again. Oh, come on. That dream again. That was the second time. What the hell? I'm human. I have to be. You okay, buddy? There's no way I was born like that. Oh, or does that mean, is he thinking he's a shadow? But you have a persona. Personas are shadows. Mm. I won't let myself get worked up over some dream. Okay. I'm sure everything will be clear if we can get to the depths of mementos. All right, um, mm. you doing okay, buddy? You want to come up closer? You want to rest on the pillow? <laughs> I'll make some room for you if you want. Oh, poor Morgana. He's being terrorized by these night terrors. Poor little guy. Oh, look, we got our uniform back in our, um... Yeah, because it's October, so now we got our uniform back into our regular one. Uh, what do you think will happen to Okumura Foods? Shucks. Well, even if the CEO has his change of heart, the, uh, the company's image is still in ruins. I imagine their stocks plummeted. Uh, do you think Okumura really exploited his employees? Every little rumor goes viral these days. What if it was all just a lie? If so, the real victims here are the employees themselves. Nah, the rumors about Okumura Foods were uh, all well known in the industry. You're overthinking it. Uh-huh. 
Tons and tons of rumors about Okumura. Hey, did you hear? The sports meet went pretty great. The way they overcame all the odds and made it to, uh, made it into the victory stand, it was like something out of a movie. Yeah, they put on a stellar performance this time. They must have been training really hard. It's nice to see uh, people's smiles on their fa- on their fa- are on their faces now. Wait, you actually went to watch? Seriously? I get what you mean though. Maybe I'll go and cheer for them too. Um, is that something I should do? Strange to not hear them talking about fan these every other second. Uh, and now we wait, like usual. Uh, that's not an excuse to slack off. We should use our time wisely. As I will, Morgana. And we have six instant messages. That's a new record. It always was around five. Okay, what do we got? Oh, that's because freaking that. Okay, about Aiko, Shibuya people watching. What are we doing? What are your plans? What's the plan? Um, hmm. We haven't hung out with Futaba in a long... We haven't actually got to hang out with Futaba at all. So I think we can hang out with her. Uh, I'm very excited. I'm feeling kind of anxious. So I came outside LeBlanc. Let me know what's up. I don't care what it is. Uh, I guess we can go and talk to her, because I do have a Hermit Persona, too. <laughs> Are you really just gonna... I, I would just imagine, like, you know, let me just chill, walking by and... Hey, Futaba, just, like, sitting like that. Oh, my gosh, that's so funny. Hey, Futaba, what's up? <laughs> We've done all we can. Now we wait. Uh, oh, that's right. Um, well, sorry about what happened in Akihabara. I really messed up. Uh, Futaba looks really depressed. Maybe you should cheer her up. Uh, okay, with my current level of kindness. Okay, good. Uh, that police office, uh, officer, he was a, a way higher level than me. <laughs> uh, you did well, Futaba. Yeah, I guess you're right. I mean, I managed to buy some stuff after that, but that was only because you were there. Anyways, can we go to, uh, can we go up to your room? I want to talk to you some more. Sure, um, buy corn. Yeah, let's go ahead. Hang out with Futaba. Okay, let's go, Ren. So what's up, Futaba? Akihabara was lots of fun. I think I want to try going somewhere else sometime. And where would you want to go? Uh, it sounds like Sojira really wants me to go back to school. Like, actual school? But online classes are better for studying. I wouldn't even have to leave the house. Um, that's a great idea, Futaba. <laughs> yeah, Ain't yeah. it? I can attend classes without even getting out of bed. Though, I don't know if Sojira would really consider that going to school. I mean, <laughs> the current situation of the world may tell you otherwise. School... Futaba? Oh, was she bullied in school or something? Um, um, to be honest, I really do want to go back. Do you think I'll be able to? Um, do you want me to help? Maybe? Really? Of course I do! You better not go back on your word! I won't, don't worry. I... I'm gonna do my best! <laughs> okay, Nino. Uh, oh, that's right. Oh, I should make a promise list! A promise list? My mom used to have me do that all the time! She'd uh, write my goals for the month, like uh, cleaning the house or running errands for her. Then, when I'd finish one, she'd mark it off with a big stamp. Uh, she always used to write these comments, too. Those were the best. Oh, and once I finished all my goals, she would take a day off uh, a day off work to spend time with me. Aw, that's so sweet. It's decided, then. I'm going to make a promise list. Time to get my ideas ready. All right, so who? what's your the rewards going to be, though? All done. Uh, so, these are my promises. One. Go somewhere with lots of people. Getting used to big crowds is key. Uh, two, go to school. I want to see the, what the inside of a normal high school looks like. Three, learn about my generation. I definitely need more info. Four, have a normal conversation with a stranger my age. Hmm. How's that? Um, I think that sounds pretty good, Futaba. Uh, I'm not uh, setting for a, uh, I'm not setting a deadline for this, by the way. I want to try and finish them all, uh, all of them someday. Uh, you're gonna have to help me though. I'll work even harder with my navigation in return. Okay, since Futaba's trusting me. Trust, trust. What? Why is her freaking Arcana just some like old man sticking his tongue out? That's weird. Um, chance to fully map a floor of mementos without entering that floor. Oh, that's cool. All right. Memento scan. I like that. Not in palaces, but only mementos. That's so um... useful. So, um, if I finished all the promises, do you think I could have a reward? Uh, yeah, but what kind of reward? I know it's kind of weird to ask, but having a, a reward waiting at the finish line will totally push on, uh, totally push me onward. Right. Anyways, I got this. Though I'm kind of exhausted from making the list, so tomorrow I got this. Tomorrow. <laughs> Do not put off tomorrow. What can be done today, Sensei Wu? Okay. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna make like a hedgehog and roll out of here. All right, Sonic. <laughs> Yo, did he just spin dash? <laughs> oh, hey, Futaba. What's going on? Hoy, it is I! <laughs> Thanks for attempting to, uh, spending time with me today. Taking out the promise list uh, brought back memories from when I worked on it with my mom. Hey, 
I'm gonna, uh, if I finish the promise list and start going to school, do you think it'd make Sojiro happy? Um, I bet it will. Right? Right? Okay, that's another reason I gotta work at this. I wanted to think of something I could do for Sojiro, but that's all I got for now. Well, I think that's good enough. But first, I gotta be the fin I gotta finish the promise list. Doing this alone would be like omega hard. Trying to solo a final boss. I mean, people do it. But now I got you in my party. Heh <laughs> I'm counting on you. So, uh, so yeah, I'm stoked. Let's start Phantom Thieves Quest uh, Four, Quest of the or Chapters of the Thieves. Sure, we've got only, uh, only a, we've only got a party of two, but don't worry about that. Bye for now. <laughs> All right, gotta bring in like video game terminology into it. I got you. I think she was talking around the lines of Dragon Quest or something. Uh, what's up now? Okuruma stuff? Inmate. Oh, inmate. I trust you haven't forgot about your special assignment. We will be waiting in front of our door. We expect you, uh, you, expect you to accept this task with enthusiasm. Okay, maybe I'll do that, Justine. Oh, or maybe not. Let's see. Hmm, father's begun acting a little odd lately. He, is, uh, he has been cooped up in his study, and his voice lacks energy. Uh, that actually sounds quite similar to what Madarame went through. And Madarame still had a change of heart in the end. Don't worry, Haru. Is that so? Oh, my apologies. I don't mean to doubt you or anything. Nobody was accusing you of that. People just act uh, a bit weird after their treasure gets stolen. It'd be hard not to worry about uh, such a sudden shift. Um, uh, it'll be okay, Haru. I mean, will it? <laughs> right. Uh, hmm, I feel better after consulting with you all. Thank you. Looks like this Okumura case is finally going to have a happy ending. Let's hope so. All that we have to do now is wait for his change of heart. I don't know, Morgana. Something just seems off hey, this time. Hey. That broken laptop? PC tool? Okay, um, perfect project fixing at your work desk? Okay, maybe sometime. Um, who else is calling, by the way? Yo? Uh, maybe yo, uh, yo some other time. Hey. Ooh, I like this, like, I just like this new, uh, not really new. I, it was in the beginning of the game. I just like this, uh, this outfit on Joker. It looks really cool. Anyway. Let's talk to these little freaks. I wanted to talk to Akeki, but I think we can talk to them for just tonight. Uh, all right, time to name the location. Justine, you do the honors. No. Uh, listen closely. The place we wish you to, uh, I wish to evaluate, evaluate you for your rehabilitation is where one offers up faith and words of devotion. A church? Every day, lost sheep flock there to pray. There are even cases where individuals will confess to crimes. Uh, confessing one's crimes due to a fear of divine punishment. This has a familiar ring to our own inmates' rehabilitation. Does such a location sound familiar to you? Well, if you know where it is, then escort us there immediately. Uh, the church in Kana Arkanda. What do you do? So, what'll it be? Uh, you mean the church? Uh, oh, so it's called a church. Let's witness this so-called faith that humans offer with our own two eyes. Guide me, Lead us there, inmate, now. <laughs> You know, Carolyn's like the oh. aggressive one, and Justine's like the passive one, but like, I'm, I think I'm more scared of Justine, honestly. Anyway, uh, so, this is where one prays to the gods in your world. Uh, the peaceful atmosphere here is, uh, is the antithesis of a prison cell. Is that how you're gonna compare it? Hmm, is that man there standing, or is that man standing there one of the gods? Uh, sure is. <laughs> no, that's definitely a human. I don't sense any exceptional abilities from him. Any more thoughtless answers like that, and we'll ex execute you here and now. Oh, yo, I think Igor would be mad at you guys if you did that. Oh, what is that over there? A smaller room? Is that like a confessional thing? Oh, I know. It's an Iron Maiden for reforming criminals, right? Whoever goes inside fails rehabilitation uh, and fails rehabilitation gets skewered. Um, it's a confession booth, guys. Just calm down. Confession booth? You mean this tiny box is where the crimes are confessed? Uh, is something the matter? <laughs> little children. Hey you, we're here for the confession booth deal you have going on here. Oh, you seek to the confess? At such a young age? Alright, which uh which of you would like to go first? What are you which saying? of us? Do you intend to split us up and pick us off one by one? Hm, <laughs> no such luck. We're both going in. Uh, um, I see. You're free to do so, but there really isn't much room inside. Are uh, they gonna cram in there? Are you attempting some sort of deceptive practice by calling yourself a servant of the gods? You what? Listen to people's concerns? This isn't a form of rehabilitation. Regardless, such talk is cheap, but pays quite well. We shall undertake this confession and ascertain the truth for ourselves. Then, uh, as for your confession... Hmm, what to confess? It's probably, uh, unkind to kick the inmate, but it's part of my duties as warden, so that can't be held against me. Inmate? Warden? 
Uh, this is none of your business. We're speaking to the gods right now. Recently, I've been shifting my more, uh, more mundane bookkeeping responsibilities onto Caroline. What? You what? I knew my workload was getting larger for some reason. <laughs> but she made so many mistakes in her work that I regret not doing it myself. Excuse me? <laughs> of course I'd make mistakes when I have nearly twice the work. How about yourself, Caroline? Or, or how about yourself, Caroline? Don't you have anything you'd like to confess while we're here? Uh huh. Like what? <laughs> I know. I know you went out and ate men menchikatsu all by yourself. Do you really think you could escape my notice? I was curious about the line. Like what humans would uh, would want so badly that they would stay in a place for so long? <sighs> uh, Megi Doleo. What? Fine, fine, fine. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Confession time is over. We're done here. The poor priest. Odd as it may be, I actually feel quite refreshed. Uh, uh, were it not for this opportunity, we would have likely kept these matters locked away deep in our hearts. Um, have you righted your wrongs, children? That's your job, inmate. <laughs> know your place. I'm sorry. By the way, uh, why do humans pray to gods? Shouldn't they be spending that time trying to solve their problems themselves? Um... It's a kind of support, I guess. Have you given up on taking care of your own issues? What, whatever happened to confidence, little children gremlins? Uh, perhaps you're the one who needs, or perhaps you're the one who needs the change of heart. No, please. No matter. We've come to learn how these uh, places of worship, uh, or, or worship, work firsthand. We'll consider the uh, assignment complete. Here is your reward. Samarikarm. I need a taro kaja, please. <laughs> You know, confessions seem like they'd be uh, rather useful to your rehabilitation. You ought to confess to us every day. Uh, put that out of mind, Caroline. Once we return, you're going to tell me about your experience eating you-know-what. <laughs> what? But I've already confessed! <laughs> Not enough, you haven't. <laughs> Look at her, she looks ashamed. Take us back now, inmate. Alright, follow me, children. <laughs> oh, what do we got now? I can't wait for his public apology. They should just execute everyone who causes trouble for society. Ooh, maybe they could take down my boss. Politicians who knock the fan at these are just sore losers. What about a Ketchikun? Is he too afraid of backlash to comment? I don't know. I don't know, dude. It's a little, little crazy. Uh, that reminds me. Yeah, yeah. Home shopping program, as always. Only one instant message for today. Interesting. Um, well, we do have to go get our freaking juice for the day as well. Oh, this increases knowledge? I don't even need to drink it then, because my knowledge is already maxed. Okay, Yusuke, hello. Um, do we have... Okay, let's work on our deal first, because I want to double that card that I just got. What card was it called, though? I don't even remember. I think it was Samakara Karm. So I'm going to do that one. Yeah, absolutely duplicate that. And then, we can hang out with him. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, should I answer his text, technically? I don't know if I, if I don't answer it, then I don't think I might get the points. Let's just let's just make sure. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, go with him. Yes, thank you. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, at the church? Hmm. Our prior theme, love. It proved to be quite useful for me indeed. I was just here. Interesting. After our enlighten, uh, enlightening session, I once attempted, uh, I once again attempted to paint. However, nothing I put on the canvas was to my satisfaction. Before the gods of art, I am not but a lost sheep. Oh. Ah, yes, lost sheep. I've come here uh, with you for that uh, for precisely that reason. I am a sheep. I am a sheep, Ren. <laughs> Indeed. Our, our theme today shall be anguish. I shall paint the anguish Christ felt as uh, felt as he bore the sins of mankind. Okay. Um. You gonna paint hmm. Jesus? Hmm. I have seen various sculptures and paintings on the matter, but merely replicating them will not do. Would any believers be willing to model and help me capture the uh, true essence of anguish? Uh. It seems not. Are they, is he actually talking to people? Very well. Ren, you will have to be my model today. Um. Uh. Make me beautiful, Yusuke. I can only represent the reality of my base subject. Anything more would be asking too much. Oh, Come on. I try. Uh, now then. Let us begin. Show me a pose that would put the anguish of Christ on full display. Uh, I guess. <laughs> hmm. I see. So this would be... No, perhaps... Uh, it seems this is not working. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing my best over here. <laughs> my arms are tired. I would like to capture anguish, yet you remain calm and composed. Can you please stop being cool every single second? <laughs> even in, uh, the slightest wrinkle can change one's impression of things. I shall not compromise even for this sketch. I'm sorry. 
I didn't mean to ruin your no. sketch. Now, raise your hands higher. More, give me more anguish. Bring it to its upper limits. Like this. <laughs> this position. So this is the passion of the Christ. Forsaken by his disciples, abhorred by a criminal to the uh, by the public, pierced with nails and hung on the cross. I understand now. This is the true <laughs> anguish of the passion. Uh, it feels as though something is boiling up within me. Uh, wh what are you children doing? <laughs> uh, well, this is an art study. Art? That? I am attempting to paint anguish, so I decided to use the crucifixion of Christ as a point of reference. So you're interested in the anguish of the crucifixion? Hmm, while it is true that Jesus' crucifixion on the cross is a symbol of deep suffering, it also bears a much more positive message, one of resurrection, of forgiveness. Oh? Resurrection? Forgiveness? I'm not sure I understand. Those ideas are contrary to my conception of anguish. I mean, it's a, it's a, long, it's a long story, you know? <laughs> it may be dis uh, difficult to grasp what I'm saying right now. But try to consider that anguish, uh, that the anguish one may feel today will someday bring forth a new hope. Ah, but, and by the way, I suggest you may contain your excitement while you're here. You may trouble the congregation. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Yusuke. So those shocking de 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 depictions were actually meant to represent forgiveness, not pain. Hmm, hope from anguish. I'm not sure I understand. I must learn more about the hearts of men. Ren, do you think I'll be able to capture the truth someday? Um, uh, I'm sure you will, Yusuke. Don't give in just yet. Indeed, if I do not have any belief in my own abilities, I will never come to accomplish anything. Hmm. <laughs> this is exceedingly strange, though. Spending time with you has helped me discover new aspects of myself. You are perhaps a mirror of sorts. A mirror of many different players who play the silent pro tag of Persona 5 Royal? I'm in your if there is anything I can do in return, please let me know. I wish to repay your kindness. No problem, Yusuke. Yeah, bond growing deeper. Let's do this. What is this? Are we at five now? Yes, we are. Allows Yusuke to create any skill card he has copied once before. Can't he already do that? Oh, create. Meaning, like, if he's copied before, he can just create it as if I've... In case I've already used it up. That's cool. I like right. that. So he doesn't just copy. He can now, like... Conjure, I guess. Hmm. Let us return home for today. I bid you farewell. D <laughs> farewell. <laughs> Don't do that to me. <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> That's the thumbnail See. right there. Goodbye, Ren. Unless something else stupid happens, I'm using that as a thumbnail. That is perfect. Absolutely perfect. Oh, hey, what's up, Yusuke? <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, apologies for this call. Could I talk to you about something? Sure. Hit me up. Uh, the crucifixion supposedly symbolizes resurrection, forgiveness, and hope, but I could not grasp those connections. Once again, I made the same mistake of picking up on the only on only the superficial meaning. The more I think about it, the further I seem to be from understanding the abyss of the heart. I don't know. Um. Uh, there's still hope. You have to keep drawing. Don't overthink it. There's still hope, Yusuke. Ah, so my anguish is what le uh, leads me to my hope. It's exactly what I learned earlier today. That's why I said that. Yeah. Thank you, Ren. Perhaps what I need is a change of perspective. Maybe. I still have a tough road ahead, but talking to you gave me some relief. I am truly fortunate to have you by my side. I'll see you later. Yes, wonderful. A whoosh. <laughs> All right, now can we talk to Akeki? Maybe. Um, father was cooped up in his study again today. His reaction was quite vague when I spoke to him too. Is this what normally happens? Madarame was in a similar state after he changed his heart. It'll be okay. Don't worry. All we have to do is wait. You're right. I'll just believe this is going to work. Thank you, and so and sorry for asking you so many times. I'll message you again if there's more progress. I get why Haru is worried, but let's just wait for the change of heart to go through. Uh huh. That's all Don't we can worry. do. It'll be just like it always is. I hope. Classic sci-fi. Well, I think I might hang out with uh, Tora today, but um, or Yoshida. Uh, oh, movie theater. Um. Back to Ninja, I'm sorry, I'll decide later. I'm not gonna go see that movie. I'm sorry, Futaba. Um, I think I'm gonna go talk with this guy, because it is Sunday. Uh, I'll be giving a speech at the usual spot today. Are you free today? Do you think you'd help me out? I think I will. Um, yeah, let's do it. Thanks. I would like to. I would like for you to hold up the placard again. The one that says I'm giving a speech, even though it's quite obvious. Please, hold up the sign that says I've sp a street speech. <laughs> Hello, nobody. Hello. Passing on the societal ills we are- oh, there they are. <laughs> we have created the next generation. It is not right. It will take time to solve this problem. However, we may start by making small changes. Uh-huh. Did you get any, any attention? I hope you gleaned something useful from today's speech. 
Regardless of the audience's size, you must convey your thoughts as if you're talking one-on-one. -on -one. See, I... I could actually take this guy's advice, because, like, I totally get that. Whenever I see, like, some videos that don't do well, I'm just like, well... Even if that video only got 30 views, that's still 30 people. That can fill up, like, an entire classroom of students. And, like, it's, it's, it's nice to think about things in that way. Like, when I see a video that gets, like, 100 views, it's like, if I had to go up and talk in front of 100 people, that's, like, a little scary. And, like, these videos average around, like, 60-ish views. So, like, if I had to, that's, like, me getting up in front of somebody and talking to 60 people. So, regardless of the audience size, I have to convey my thoughts as if I'm talking to you. I am talking to you right now. So that's just, it's interesting, it's a nice connection, even though we can't really talk back and forth. I don't know, it's nice though. Uh, by the way, I forgot to ask you the last time we spoke, why do you want to become a politician? Um, I want to change the world, Lucina! Mm -hmm. Uh, ambitious indeed, if a little ambiguous. Well, I'm sure you'll iron out the details as you go along. Oh, was that the right answer? May I ask you one more question? What kind of politician do you want to be? Um... One with conviction, probably. Ah, yes, don't ever forget that. Although, what's important is what lies within. I'll, I'll, allow me to give you some advice. Uh, if you aspire to get into politics, you must possess a central philosophy. Wh what is it that you want to accomplish? That is the foundation of a great speech. You'd do well to remember that. Um, uh, that was helpful, sir. I'm glad. By the way, my philosophy is Very never well. give up until your voice is heard. Uh, to get your message across, be tenacious in conveying your thoughts to the audience. Have a firm point of view and communicate it clearly. That's the first rule of negotiating. <laughs> you have me uh, reliving the fighting spirit when I had first became a politician. Well, that's good. You should explain the basic of speech giving. I feel like my bond with him is growing deeper. Well, thanks. I might actually use that advice IRL. Uh, occasionally ask for more money or item. Ooh. All right. That's actually epic. More money and more items? Yo. Uh, get the heck out of here, no good Tora. Uh-oh. No good Tora. Don't freak out. They're right. I am no good. Oh, come on, dude. Ah, my apologies. We're done for today. I feel like, oh, uh, my charm, really? Okay. I mean, thanks for the free charm. You and Oya, I guess, are going to keep giving me free charm. That's that's awesome. I shall ask Thank you, you for all your hard work. I'll see you next time. Oh, and you're going to call me too? Wait, did I give you my cell phone? I think I did, yeah. Hey, I wanted to thank you for today. No problem. I'm sorry you had to see me acting like such a coward, right after I gave you that self-important lecture, too. But I am quite a stubborn individual myself. I hope today's incident was at least a good example of what not to do, but... What do you think? Did you take anything useful from it? Um... Just keep saying it was helpful, I guess, just constantly. Ah, that's a relief. I have to say, it was almost nostalgic for me. It reminded me of my early days. Uh, I hope our talks from now on will keep you, uh, will keep giving you the direction you need. Well, I hope to see you again soon. Goodbye. Yeah, see you, Mr. Tora. Not no good, Tora. I know you can do change in the world, Mr. Man. Oh, uh, Kasumi? What? Excuse me, but could you please repeat that? Wait, Maruki is there, um... Now, nothing's been decided as of yet. But at the rate that things are going... Yoshizawa-san's honor status could possibly be revoked. Wait, why? What happened? Something so serious should, of course, be brought to the attention of both her parents and yourself. Also, why are you saying her when she's right there? Uh, that's a little odd. What's wrong? What, sh what happened? I've been told that her results at the latest meet were quite laudable. Yeah, um... Isn't revoking her status as an honor student a bit of an overreaction on the school's part? Yeah, I agree. Jeez, Maruki, stand up for her. I understand how you feel, but... Well, third place doesn't really cut it in this case. Third place? Come on, that's amazing. Like, how many people were there? There are probably tons of people there, and she got third place? She needs to attain first place results for her exceptional status to be worthwhile. Oh, shut up. Come on. Don't get me wrong here. Uh, personally, I think her results are impressive, but... But? I suppose the argument could be made that if she's going to represent Shujin and receive special treatment, it's not enough. Oh, come on. Third place is still really good. I know there's, like, that stupid meme about the guy who, like, goes crazy while being in third place, but, like, third place is not bad. You should be proud of yourself that you can even make it that far. Like, first place is really, really hard to get, and I know Kasumi's working really hard. 
But like, oh, um, that's so mean. Please don't shoot the messenger here, okay? All right. This is necessary to guarantee fairness across the entire student body. I mean, I get where you're coming from, dude, but like... It's not as if you've been expelled or the like. Another meet's coming soon. Please try for the results the school wants to see. Come on, you think she's not? Sir, putting excessive expectations on Yoshizawa-san will only be to her detriment. I agree. Maruki's right. Oh, that wasn't at all my intention. I just wanted to give her a little encouragement. Well, no, you're more... Instead of that, you're pressuring her. You're literally saying, Hey, you didn't get... You didn't say it in the right way, I guess. He was like, Can you please get first place so that the school looks good? Rather than do your best... And something like that. I don't know. Like you were, you said it the wrong way. Dr. Maruki, please continue serving the student body as counselor and providing support to Yoshizawa-san. Yeah, because he actually provides support for her, not tells her what to do. This meeting was merely meant to express how the entire faculty will be supporting her. Uh huh. And putting more pressure on her. That's the reason I had you sit in today, Dr. Maruki. Oh. Supporting her. I see. Marky, you probably understand just like I do. At any rate, that's all I wanted to discuss with you today. Please keep in mind, these changes are all hypothetical. Uh, unless Yoshizawa-san doesn't provide better results. Yeah, let me just remind you once again that if you fail, you're going to lose that honor status. <laughs> oh, come on. Well, uh, I suppose we should wrap up here. She said she did, she said she did so good, too. She was like, it was the best I ever done or something like that. Like... She was so proud of herself, and now, oh, oh, Kasumi. Excuse me. Oh no, she's sad. What's wrong with Yoshizawa? Oh wait, did she drop a third place ribbon or something? Didn't she seem off to you? No, she's sad. Did she? Let me guess. That's her third place ribbon or something. Is it? Oh. It's... No, it's the good luck truck. No. Oh. Yoshizawa must have dropped it. I feel so bad. I'm gonna cry because like. See, if it was, like, someone who was, I guess, how do I put this? I don't want to say that she's not strong, but, like, it's because she's being told, I don't know, I feel so bad because, like, if it was, like, Ryuji, I wouldn't feel as bad because, like, I feel like Ryuji, he can just, like, pass it up, but, like, Kasumi can't, she's, like, she has really, I guess she has a really hard time failing, I guess, I don't know, that's her charm. Oh! Shoot, she's gone. Let's return it after school. This almost makes me want to we cry. We should at least send her a text so she knows where it is. Okay. Oh my gosh. I was almost... What she was like, excuse me. Oh. Hmm. Maybe I left it in here. Her charm? Is she coming back huh? for the... How do you know she's always on handle the news? No. No, no, no. Don't say anything worse. She seemed pretty downcast. I think it was quite the shock to her. Wait, Maroki's there though. I truly hope this is what finally drives her to succeed. That's stupid vice principal. She needs to push herself beyond third place and bring home some stronger results. And soon. Uh, vice principal, I know I've already told you this, but your approach here is going to affect her adversely. Right, tell him, Maruki. Trying to motivate her with harsh words is only going to give her more anxiety. Yes, please. Ah. <sighs> Dr. Maruki, we aren't running a charity. If she's going to receive special treatment, she needs to provide adequate results. I mean, I totally get what you're saying, but like, the way you're supporting her is not... Praising her until her head swells may be your idea of therapy, but we can't afford to just butter her up forever. It's not praise, it's genuine support. We took in those sisters to improve Shujin's standing, but at this rate, we're only going to end up suffering for it. Those sisters? Wait, are you talking about, wait, Kasumi's sister who died? Not only have we lost one of them, but the other one's not doing us any good. <laughs> Talk about a waste of effort. Don't say that about one of your students, jeez. Oh. <laughs> no. Sir. Maroki. So, uh, pardon me. No. So no First with Mr. Kamishida, now the principal's death. We've got our backs to the wall here. No. Uh, if this school doesn't bounce back soon, even my own ass will be on the line. No, see, I know, see, Kasumi? I know exactly what she's gonna think. She's gonna pressure herself even more to get first place. That's what she's gonna do. See, I, I know, I can tell by her character. What she is gonna do here, she's not gonna say, oh, the vice principal is mean for thinking that of me, or these adults are rotten for thinking that thing. She's gonna immediately think, I'm not doing bad, I'm not doing good enough. I have to save the school. She's gonna take responsibility for that. She's gonna feel responsible for that. I know. That'll be all. Excuse me. I know that's how she's gonna feel. Oh, no. 
Oh, I feel so bad. Oh, I want to cry. I'm gonna. Oh, shut up. Hmm, to be honest, I'm fed up with how happy people have been acting. Stealing hearts, social reform. Don't give me the fant. Ah, oh, this fant of these nonsense. It's also unscientific. Uh, cognitive science, dude. I mean, how could they target Big Bang Burger and Okumura Foods? They're criminals. That artificially consummate flavor, enough volume to fill a small universe? Are the Finithies trying to steal the galaxy of junk food from me? I love these chips! <laughs> you. That said, I'm a mia -kun. What's up, lame teacher? Perhaps you think you understand how vast the universe is, full of countless galaxies, but consider this! If we use the three watermelons in the sun to visualize a certain matter's size against the universes, what are the melons? Um... Probably moons because they're shaped like like I think of watermelon and I think of like either a circle or like a like a watermelon slice that looks like a moon, right? Moons. Mm. Too bad. It seems you. I was wrong about you. I was wrong about you too. I I thought I, giving you a funny voice was cool, but now I'm starting to regret it. The answer is stars. It is meant to convey the density of stars and the vestige of space. Three bees in the whole world, uh, in the whole of Europe, also works. Uh, in other words, the universe is essentially empty. There are countless stars in the sky, but the universe is even more vast than that. Even within our own galaxy, the stars are separated by a great distance, despite the sheer volume of them visible. Um, that was an easy one, wasn't it? I knew that one. Ha ha ha, make fun of him. Ha ha ha, funny, funny. Too close, but yet so, uh, but yet far. Hehe, <laughs> you could say the same of our hearts. Yeah, uh, if only he knew the places we've been. Yeah, tell me about it, Morgana. Oh, okay, can we give her charm back, please? Uh, uh, are you I'm sorry. I just now noticed that you tried to reach me. Wait, her voice is all... My smartphone seems to be acting up again. Yeah, your voice is all, like, funny filtered. And you found my good luck charm, right? Yeah, I did. Um, can we meet up? Oh, Diva, in front of the stadium, where we met before. <laughs> oh, she looks so She's sad. She's at the stadium? <gasps> no. Senpai, sorry, I can't hear you. Uh, I guess her signal cut out. Um, I couldn't hear everything, but it seems like she's at the stadium. Yeah, let's go. She seemed to be acting unusually this morning, too. Do you think something happened? I do. Um, maybe she's sad. Uh. Like the last time we met her there? It's possible. <laughs> well, let's see how she's doing when we drop off her good luck charm. Oh. To Odaiba, right? Odaiba, right. Oh. Kasumi, are you okay? <laughs> No connection. We should have gotten this thing replaced already. Yeah, funny enough, I actually got a new phone recently. Not like anything special, it was just like... I can play Fire Emblem Heroes on two different phones now, I guess. <laughs> uh. I'm so useless. No. I do nothing but cause trouble for Senpai. And even Dr. Maruki. No, no. I'm supposed to be THE Kasumi Yoshizawa. Oh. Come on, I want to get a parfait. Uh... Yeah, yeah, just a sec. I'm looking up a spot right now. It's supposed to be somewhere around here. Huh? What's this? Uh, you've gotten us totally lost. I don't recognize any of these places. What's that building even supposed to be, anyway? The building? Um... Uh, I think they're building some kind of convention center. Or was it a research lab? I forgot at the moment. What's it matter, anyway? Um... Kasumi? <laughs> it's not a lab. It's a stadium. Oh, okay. Hmm? Uh. Wait, what the cutscene? Oh, uh. Kasumi, hello. You okay? Uh. Beginning navigation. Huh? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, what? The meta. Wait, does she have a? Does she have a palace? Wait, her phone was. Uh, hey, is that? Hold on, what? What the heck? Uh. What? 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 What is? What is that? Uh. What? It. Oh, I, oh. What the? Morgana, put. What? Excuse me? Does she have a palace? This atmosphere. Is this a palace? Is oh, is there dis distorted desires for greatness? But we never activated the nav. Her phone glitched up. 
How did Wait. Do you think it was Yoshizawa? How did she get it on her phone? That's why I knew I knew that like the messed up phone was gonna <sighs> Could she have the nav? It's a possibility. Uh she wasn't anywhere near us when we slipped into this palace. Yeah, no, she yeah. can't fight like we do. We have to find her. Fast. Okay. Um This is concerning. We're actually just in a palace. Or are we? Uh, first, we need a way into that huge thing. Let's go. The area heading down uh, past these gates seems suspicious to me. Let's go, Joker. This is sick. Unknown palace? Yo. This is actually sick. Let's go. Get in here. What? Kasumi. <laughs> Where are you? I'm sorry, I should have come like 30 seconds earlier that we wouldn't be in this mess. What is this stadium? Is this her palace? Hold on. Can I... <sighs> Unknown. It's someone's palace. I think it's hers. It's gonna be her palace. This is so weird. We haven't even finished Okumura this thing yet. What the heck? I'm so confused. I was not expecting this. I was expecting some confidence and stuff. I don't think Yoshizawa is here. Can we go? Uh, can we get any, any further in? Um, what is this? Mm -hmm. That door might be our only option. Let's go check it out. This music. I can feel it. What the birds? I. There's no shadows. Uh, birds. Why are there birds? I'm so confused. Wait, should I read something? What is? Or is this a hide? That's a hide. There's no shadows here. Why would I hide? Um, this has got to be Kasumi's palace. Why else would she be saying like, I'm the Kasumi Yoshizawa, I have to do this. She's got distorted desires. Maybe for her sister to come back to life or something, or maybe for just greatness. No good, we'll have to find another way. A grapple hook maybe? Uh, oh. Joker, look, up there. Grapple hook? Uh, looks, to my, uh, looks to me like that could be a foothold. Let's see if there's a way to climb up. Okay, such as grapple hook? Uh, yes? Oh, up here. Here we go. This could work. Oh, and then grapple hook. Kacha! So, Kasumi, if you're there, please. I'm sorry, I'm gonna reveal, reveal to you that I'm a Phantom Thief, but like, I gotta. I can't, I don't want you to die in here, but there are no shadows though, as well. This is so weird. I. <laughs> Who's there? It's it, there. Was that Yoshizawa? Yeah, um, let's move. Yeah. Stay on guard, though. I am. Don't worry. What is that heart? Is that... Is that her heart? I... Kasumi. There she is. Wait. It's... Why? How are you here? Wait. Hold on. Are you saying you? Wait, is this her sister? Or is this her? Who's that? Is she a cognitive being? I... Don't know? I... Girl in leotard. Is that her? It's my fault. It's Kasumi. Isn't it? What? Um. Come on. I. Okay. Uh. You must. Kasumi. What? Stop! Stop it! I'm. Uh oh. Kasumi, I. What's going on? Is she? What the? What? What? What the heck? What's happening? You must. You must what? What? What was that? Th what? What is that? What the heck is that thing? That's not Black Hurry. Mask. Yoshizawa's in trouble. Who? What did they kill? Heresy. Huh? You dare to spurn our Lord's mercy? What? <laughs> what the? That's a shadow. That's just a shadow. Are you alright, Yoshizawa? Oh boy. <laughs> Are you hurt? Senpai? Yeah, uh, sorry, I'm a phantom thief. <laughs> Looks like that thing's ready to rumble. G that's a new shadow! Set yourself. Our lord laments the foolishness birthed from your pain. What? I... What are you talking about? She doesn't know, either? I heard the school moved her to Sam period. It must be nice getting it perks like that. Oh, no. Here are these voices. These are the... These are the voices that came... That they were talking about her. Me off sometimes. Oh. Getting special treatment is like, like, like whatever if it's deserved. But do you think she's earned it? 
Oh, all the voices. I understand how you feel. Like, 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 well, third place doesn't really cut it. Third place. Shut she up. She needs to attain first place results for her exceptional status to be worthy. Oh, this is her palace. Not only have we lost one, but the other one is not doing as any good. Boy. <laughs> Was that her? Did that shadow kill her shadow? Yoshizawa? Um. You're telling me I'm not cutting it? As if I don't know that better than anyone! Oh. Still, I don't care what anyone says about me. Huh? I will not tolerate anyone speaking ill of our dream! Oh, it's her sister. Oh, I feel so bad. Oh. Kasumi. Uh. <laughs> Kasumi? It's all in your best interest. Your? As in society? As in the people around you? She looks so sad. Spending my life with this pressure. Demanding the results that you want. Yoshizawa? Could she be? I and think now so. now you're all branding me a failure? Let me remind you who you're talking to. I am. You are? I am. Come on. Kasumi Yoshizawa! That's right! So adamant. Oh? <laughs> You're awakening in your- Rather than acceptable uh, and cinders. Uh, you strive towards splendor. Uh, you know the rest. This is so out of the blue! Uh, if those really are the shoes you've chosen. The shoes? <laughs> then we'll dance to the end. What is your persona? Oh, the mask! This has got to be- You got- you know it, you know it! This is so, like, out of nowhere! She already knows what to do! <gasps> Wait, what? Her persona is... Is... Like, her sister, kind of? Oh. I... Or is this her? I'm so... Is her sister even involved with this? Uh, okay. What's with the... Sailor Moon transformation? <laughs> uh... All right. Where's your persona? Oh. Oh, it's like a, it's like a ballerina. Accept this contract. Ooh. spell cast upon you. Look like that legs are like crystals. I request we have a rematch. Oh. This time, I'm going all in with Sandrion. Sa Sandrion. Uh. Oh, oh, all right. Uh, Kasumi. Yo, look at my guy's sword, Jesus. Uh way to do this. Nothing too reckless, okay? Uh Thank you. Please do. Okay. Um Yo, what's your gut? Look at her like poses. They're all like dancing poses. Uh, she's light. She's the light. I knew it. Look at her in the bottom right. Yo, she looks sick. Kasumi, you are epic. Holy my go. Show them Sandrion. Mmm. That's good. Can we all attack? Wait, look at her go- <laughs> she, she took a second. <laughs> Yo, she looks so cool! <gasps> of course she has light. Hold on, here, let me let me get some light in here too. Let's set some light on this subject. What, come on, I have light, yeah. Let's go, justice. Man, I was wondering who was gonna be the light user. It's gonna- Wait, what? Excuse me. Shoot, don't kill her. Don't kill Kasumi. Please. Um, uh... Yeah, Diorama, heal her back up, Morgana. I want Kasumi to take this thing out. Yeah, it's, this is her fight. Koga, go! Kacha! And now he's to auto-attack again. Go for the cancel. This is so freaking out of nowhere. Wait, what if I didn't do Okuma's Palace? Like, the other day, what would... Uh, uh? Oh, bless chance, that's why. Okay, let me try this then. Makoga. There we go. Oh, I didn't want to finish it off. I'm sorry, Kasumi, I stole your thunder. Or I stole your light. I get. I don't. I don't know. I. 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 Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> you okay? Oh, of course. Yeah. Hey, are you all right? <laughs> I can't be weak anymore. Oh. Oh. Uh, no, no, no! Don't push yourself that hard. She's exhausting herself. Ah! Whoa. Yeah. Jeez. I'm quite impressed. Considering how you just awakened to your persona and all. It's because she does it every day. She puts herself through pain every day, and then people still call her a failure. Senpai, right? 
That's me. Uh, how'd you know, Kasumi? <laughs> I could tell from your voice and your posture. Ah. By the way. Uh. Why are we dressed like this now? <laughs> uh, it's a really long story. But we're the fan of these. Oh, of course. This has to be awfully confusing for her. You want to join the fan of these, Kasumi? You want to join the fan of these? Please, you want to join the fan of these? Looks like they found us. Oh, boy. Time to get out of here, quick. We can explain later. Okay. Uh, follow my lead. I'm Joker. Right. Do it. Do it. Aha. Aha. Aegon. Aegon. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. I'm sorry. I'm just like screaming his stupid smash lines. All right. <laughs> Arsene. Hey, Kasumi, want to see Arsene? Oh, we're back at. Yeah. So, how about that good luck charm? Huh? My clothes changed back to normal too. Yeah. Um. This was your location before you entered the metaverse. We all just came back. Yeah, she doesn't really know what that is. Came back? <laughs> Did we go somewhere? Like how she hasn't asked the question about the talking cat. Uh, about that. <laughs> Please, tell me anything you might know about what's going on. Uh, I need to know what just happened to me. She deserves to know. How the heck did her... A Was it Igor? Did Igor put it on? He was like, hey, hey, you know what, trickster? Let's just let's just give her a hey, hey Justine, Carolyn, watch this. <laughs> it's gonna be so funny, right? <laughs> I know how you feel, but what should we do? Uh uh I I'll let's tell her. She deserves to know. Yeah, you're right. Plus, she's a good friend. I don't think she'll rat us out. Okay. I'll tell you everything from the beginning. Well, I wanna say, I wanna be the cool one. Okay. Thank you. Fine. She sounds a little, a lot more confident. A metaverse with palaces and personas. Yep. I'm sure it's not easy to wrap your head around all of this in one go. Yeah, it's tough. Normally I wouldn't believe any of that, but after seeing it all for myself. Yeah, it's quite a, quite a good story. Uh, wow, you're so good at explaining things, Mr. Kitty. Uh-huh. I'll let that last part slide this time. <laughs> But isn't there something else that should be surprising you? The fact that he is a cat? Huh? A cat's talking? Nice. Nice, Kasumi. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Took you long enough. Yeah, please. And I am not a cat. I am Morgana. Right. I see. I also see. Well, since you seem to know a lot more about this than I do, maybe I should call you Morgana-senpai. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's right. Don't you have something for her? Oh yeah, um, so yeah, about all- So just ignore all, like, the, you know, fantasy, magical stuff that's happened. Do you want that paper good luck charm back? Uh, good luck charm. Here you go. <laughs> you came all this way to return this? Thank you so much. No problem. It was precious to you, so I didn't want to have didn't you lose seem it. You did your usual self this morning. Did something happen? Oh, is she gonna have to talk about this now? Well, I didn't get a chance to tell you yet, but... I got third place in the last meet. That's, I want to congratulate her, but I know she's disappointed in herself. Of course I'm not happy about it, but it looks like the school is even more displeased. I know. Oh my I goodness. I was summoned to the guidance office this morning. I was warned that the school might revoke my honors status if I don't improve my results soon. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Kasumi. <laughs> it would be due to my own inability to succeed in gymnastics, so... I have to say, it's not an unfair consequence. I mean, I guess I see where they're coming from, but still. But I also overheard the vice principal talking about how I'm a useless waste of effort. Oh, come on. And I dragged Dr. Maruki into this mess, too, since he was with me when I got the news. That's what really got to me. No, he really, really wants to support you. Come on, Dr. Maruki's really, really a good guy. That's a tough break. <sighs> so I ended up coming here. And then, all of a sudden, I was in that place we just left. Yeah, kind of crazy. <laughs> but I'll be just fine now. Has she picked on the, but the fact that we're Phantom Thieves yet, Morgana? I feel like whatever happened in there helped me to get over it. I'm going to realize my dream for sure. I mean, she got her persona, so that's something. Seems like you really are on the up and up now. <laughs> but then again, how did Yoshizawa end up finding a palace in the first place? I don't know, Morgana. It sounds like it was pure coincidence based on what she's told us. I guess? Um, her smartphone. What about my phone? Yeah, um... Well, I suppose that makes the most sense. Yeah, Kasumi, uh, you know how your smartphone's acting up? If you see a weird-looking eye thing, yeah, just don't touch it. <laughs> hey, do you mind if we take a quick look at your phone? 
Yeah. If the on there, we'd be able to tell whose palace that was with the search history. Oh, it'd be, it's hers. Sure, it's right. It's hers. Sorry, this won't do any good. Huh? Is it dead? What's that? Hold on, wait, what happens if a battery dies more inside of a palace? <laughs> The battery's dead. Hold it's on. It's been acting up for a while now, so that could have something to do with it. That's actually kind of crazy. Igor, can you do something about that? What if we literally just, like, run out of batteries while we're inside the metaverse? That's kind of concerning. Oh, really? Shouldn't you get that checked out? Yeah, I probably should have a long time ago. <laughs> well, it's not like that was a palace we've been after, so... I guess it's no big deal. But a palace is a palace, Morgana. We couldn't make its ruler our target unless we reached a unanimous decision anyway. That's true. Wait, uh, uh, the target? Okay, I've been meaning to ask. Yeah. We're the Phantom Thieves, sorry. Are you two part of the Phantom Thieves? Yeah, you know. Um, well, uh, we're... <laughs> you are, aren't you? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I knew it. Don't hate me, please. Wait, that means... When we were at the cafe with Akechi san. Please don't tell Akechi, please. Please don't tell Akechi. I basically told the Phantom Thieves themselves that I don't agree with what they're doing. Yeah, I remember. <sighs> I'm really sorry. No, don't apologize for your own beliefs. Don't worry about it. With that out of the way, what's your call? Uh, about Kasumi, you mean? That's right. I don't want to control her. She sh it should be up to her decision if she wants to Considering join. Considering how she did back there, don't you think she'd make a worthy addition to the Phantom Thieves? I don't think she'll want to join. Plus, that's just more pressure on her plate. So, you mean you want me to join the Phantom Thieves? I would love for you to join, but I cannot add more to your plate. You, you are stressful. You are stressful. You are stressed enough. You are not stressful, Kasumi. In a nutshell, yeah. I mean... <sighs> You've awakened to your persona. You're aware of the existence of palaces. And from the looks of things... You've got quite the potential. If you're willing to join us, we'd be glad to have you. Uh-huh, but like, that's if only if you're willing. I see. Hmm. Well, just putting the offer on the table, Kasumi. You know what? It's, it's all you. It's all up to you. All up to you. You don't have to give us an answer right now. Right. I mean, you probably shouldn't make any decisions until you learn more about what it is we're actually doing. That's a good point as well. Literally, we can't just, like, drag her into this with an hour of... Within like 10 minutes of what she knows what's going on. Thank you, but I'm sorry. I have to turn down your offer. Uh-huh. Cool. So we'll head home for now and... <laughs> Wait. What? Yeah. When I awakened to my... Uh, persona, was it? I also realized something. Yeah, it's not... I already know. She wants to focus on her dream. And I agree with her. I agree with her. I can't keep obsessing over my shortcomings in gymnastics like this. So that's why I can't join you at the moment. At the moment? Because you need to focus on your gymnastics. Okay, but she said at the moment. I'm truly sorry to say no after all you've done for me. No, no, no. Don't feel like you owe us anything. Um, uh, that's like you, Kasumi. <laughs> Thank you. I think I'd only cause you all more trouble if I were to join up without being totally invested in it. I see. I, I totally understand. Dude, like, I get it. I get it. I get it. You're cool, Kasumi. It's fine. Of course. I won't say a word about this to anyone. I know. I trust you. I'm glad you catch on so quickly. Dude, this... Why is she so good? Why is she so... She's just so good. Well, if you ever change your mind about us... Just let us know, okay? Yeah, you will be straight. You will get the freaking VIP pass on the fate of Thieves. Thank you, Morgana Senpai. If that ever happens, I'll get in touch right away. Ah, oh, if that ever happens. Yes. Well, we, technically, we kind of saw her when she was in um the beginning palace, so maybe. I should extend the same gratitude to you as well, Senpai. Oh? I swear. One day, I will repay you for helping me out in so many ways. Uh, I mean, I guess, even though I haven't really Shall done anything. Going? The most I really did was, like, kind of talk to you, I guess. <laughs> Quite a lot's happened today, but I have a feeling I'll try harder than ever before, starting tomorrow. Really? It seems like you do that every single day. I'm glad to hear it. All right, well, good luck. Well, see you later. Yeah, good luck, Kasumi. Goodness, man, I gotta go talk to frickin' Akeki tonight. Like, if he even wants to talk... Mm. Uh, I didn't expect Yoshizawa to gain a persona. We ended up saving her, but I don't think she owes us uh, or anything. I mean... That said, she'd definitely be a huge help if she joined us. Yeah, I agree. Hey, hey another box. Oh, no way! The box! That's the highlight of today's episode! The box! 
Let's go to bed. I can't even. Oh, I need to talk to a keki though. Fine. Okay. Um. So what can I like? Can I actually have to go to bed? Yeah. All right. Well, let's sleep then. Fine. Uh, let's call it a day and go to bed. So let's go to bed. Fine. I just want to go talk to a keki. What's up, guys? Hey. Uh, I'm Mia Senpai. I'm sorry for messaging messaging you so late. My phone battery's finally recharged, so I wanted to thank you while I could. Um, can I go back to- no, you don't have to be so polite, it's okay. It's just the decent thing to do. I just wanted to thank you for today. I'm sorry that things are all- I'm sorry that thanks are all I can offer right now. I'll definitely make it up to you eventually. Um, don't worry about it, Kasumi, it's okay. No, please, it's fine. I'll have my phone fixed as soon as possible. Please let Morgana Senpai know as well. Uh, anyways, I hope you have a good night. Yeah, you too. <laughs> Oh, if only Yoshizawa would join the Phantom Thieves. What a shame. Um, there's nothing we can do for now, Morgana. Hmm. Yeah, we shouldn't press the matter. So, how are we gonna break it to the others? <laughs> uh, hey guys, Kasumi is like, knows about us. Everyone's comments are, are so, are everyone used to, everyone's comments used to be so encouraging, but now they're actually kind of frightening. This is utter chaos. The public, dis uh, the public dislike of Okumura has uh, grown exponentially as well. How are you holding up, Haru? We've been receiving anonymous threats almost every day now. That's scary. But our, our, our security is tight, so it's been okay so far. I believe things will calm down once we finish this, Haru. And what about us? Are we going to get all popular and crap again? Uh, let, us, uh, let us let us not concern ourselves with that for now. I only pray that things calm down. Yeah. Uh, I guess we still have some problems to hash out. Uh, we could do more harm than help if we brought it up at this point. Maybe we'll just stay quiet about Yoshizawa for now. Yeah, seems like we've been doing that like the entire game, except for that one time she showed up in freaking Hawaii. Uh huh. Oh hi. Uh, good morning. Hi Haru. Regarding my father, there isn't anything different about him yet. Right. I can't help but think about a lot of things when I'm just waiting. Things like, did it go well? Yeah, I know. We all get those thoughts. Don't worry. No need to worry, Haru. At least maybe. Thanks. I don't know. <laughs> Hearing that from you puts my mind at ease. I mean, I can't. I can't, you know, confirm or anything. <laughs> I guess I'll relax and look after the flower bed. I haven't been able to for a while. Oh, well, that's right. You are interested in gardening. Okay. Um, apparently gardening is like a feature in this game, and you can like grow plants that do stuff. I guess. I mean, I already have a plant in my own house. Phantom thieves are amazing. Uh, do you think the Phantom Thieves will do the same thing to that CEO as they did our principal? Whoa! I didn't do that. It wasn't me. Ah, come on, they aren't gonna murder him. Besides, I'm pretty sure the principal killed himself. No way, that was a fan of these sending a message. Wake up, people, it's time to atone, or something like that. I'd kill for that kind of power. Yikes, calm down, fanboy. <laughs> oh boy, uh, let's see, what have we even got? All right, um, <laughs> well, I think I'm gonna call it there. That was quite an episode. I was just expecting to do some confidence, but like, dang. That's gotta be Kasumi's palace! That was so weird, like, what the... Why would... The, 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 like, the thing that looked like her? I wasn't sure if that was her or her sister, or like, if that's Kasumi's palace, and that was her shadow, is Kasumi gonna have a mental shutdown? But she was fine. She wasn't like, the. So like, was that her cognition sister? We didn't really find out, because it looked a little bit different. She had like, long hair. Or so, I know Kasumi has like, cause she has it like braided up in a ponytail, right? So like, if she let it down, that's what she'd look like, I think. Or did she say her sister was like younger than her, right? She was the older one? They weren't twins, were they? I can't remember off the top. And, and, you know, I just, ugh. Gosh, you know what? We'll find out eventually. Uh, I guess thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day. This was a very odd episode. This kind of came out of nowhere, but you know what? Let's just keep on going. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. See you on the next episode. Bye bye.